This AI stuff is getting insane. It can create pictures from nothing, turn your ideas into video clips, it can help you brainstorm your next great idea, and edit your pictures like magic. It can even transform you into a cartoon, in case you ever wanted to be a cartoon. <laughs> but with so many AI tools out there, it can be hard to know which ones are worth your time. And that's why we've compiled a list of the top five most insane AI tools that are ready to change the world. These tools are so powerful, they'll make you feel like a wizard. So right away, I wanted to share a tool that I've been using on a daily basis for my work as a creative and also just for fun. It's called Mid Journey and it is mwah. I use it mostly for creating kind of cool mood boards to, um, to help me quickly brainstorm a visual concept or come up with a bunch of compositions really quickly. Now, you'll need a Discord account to use it, but from there, it's easy to prompt, revise, resize, and rethink anything you can imagine. One of my favorite tools is Zoom Out, which you can use after you kind of narrow down to your favorite version of an image. I also think that the variation controls are pretty cool. Now there's a lot going on under the hood of Mid Journey, so it's amazing right out of the box, but it only gets better the more you learn about it. But even that, even all that Mid Journey can do is only scratching the surface of the power of the next tool on my list. So Mid Journey is excellent for coming up with new visual ideas. But if you have a photo that you want to level up, Photoshop is still the greatest of all time. Now Photoshop's new AI tools have made it incredibly simple to get magical generative results in just a few simple clicks. Now first what you're going to want to do is uh, drop your image onto a large canvas. Then using your marquee selection tool, select a portion of your image and then the outside area. Photoshop will pull up this nifty new menu, look at that UI. Click Generate without a prompt, and Photoshop will extend your image to fill the canvas. So now you've got your image on a big canvas, but you want to fill that new world you've created with some generative elements. Using the Lasso tool, you can add or remove anything. So if I wanted to add some sweet furniture or some plants, now it may take a few tries, but the results are amazing. So this first couple of tools were great for creating or improving anything that you can imagine. But what if you need help imagining new ideas? AI has you covered once again, and my next tool is absolutely the droid you've been looking for. If you are a creator like me, or if you ever just need to do any kind of creative writing, you know that staring at a blank page is one of the hardest parts of any project. And that's why my next tool is one of my favorites. Now it's based on ChatGPT, and ChatGPT is incredibly powerful on its own. And I strongly suggest you check it out if you haven't already. But one of the problems I've had using ChatGPT every day was kind of needing to set up my brainstorming workspace before I could get to brainstorming. All right, so I need to tell it that I work for Zapier and I'm a video producer and I'm gonna be writing YouTube scripts. And before this app was released, Every time I sat down, I basically had to introduce myself to ChatGPT again. And there was also not really a great way to seamlessly share my brainstorming setup with the rest of my team. Now using Zapier's interfaces, I've been able to quickly build a workspace that both I and my teammates can revisit again and again in the form of a friendly chatbot. So I call this one Charlie Chatbot and they are prompted to help me with brainstorm ideas like this one. They know the general tone and purpose of my work, as well as a little bit about Zapier. They have read some examples of well-written YouTube scripts and outlines, and they have been instructed to be funny. They aren't ever really funny, but you can hope. So are you feeling like a wizard yet? Be sure to stick around until the end and make sure that you too can be a wizard. Or at least feel like one. Okay. So I make checking in with Charlie a regular part of my video brainstorming process. But what if I wanted to generate video clips directly from my brain? Well, there's an AI for that. Just head over to the website called runwayml.com. Now sign up is free and you can use the AI on any of your devices. Once you're all signed in, it's prompting time. Now I want a little movie of a cute baby robot with a cute little baby wizard. And the app will generate previews, which you can use to kind of fine tune your video before you commit to rendering it. So here's the video result. I think it's pretty dope. And here are some other examples that I was able to generate just from text and my terrible sketches and some art that I made with Midjourney. 
But really, all you need to do is write down your idea and the app will do its thing and give you an amazing little clip that you can play with. Now this, this technology is obviously cool today, but I think the best part is it's only gonna get better from here. But I promised you that you would feel like a wizard today. So let's check out my next tool. So Adobe Express's new Animate from Audio tool allows you to transform yourself into a cartoon character in seconds. It is by far the easiest way to make free animated cartoons online. Trust me, I've looked around. So first off, you gotta get some audio, and I've got some audio. AI is pretty amazing. It brought me to life in just a few seconds. And you know, it's okay, but there's a little bit of background noise. So I'm gonna take it over to Adobe's free AI powered audio enhancement tool, Enhanced Speech. After this runs, now I've got crisp, clean audio and it's ready to make some magic. Head back over to Animate from Audio and all I need to do is pick out my character. I'm gonna pick this wizardy Rasputin guy and um, I'll pick my background and size and go ahead and click the upload button and pick out that crispy new audio. So the Adobe Express AI is gonna analyze that audio and then generate a custom automatic animation for me. And I'm kind of already over this weird Rasputin guy, so uh, here's a cute little baby slice of toast. <laughs> uh, we'll be toast, you'll feel like toast. The character I picked will move around, do different hand gestures, head movements, all sorts of things. And the lip sync is gonna line up perfectly with all the different mouth shapes of the words that I say. AI is pretty amazing. It brought me to life in just a few seconds. So this makes it really easy to create fun and compelling animations really quickly. Hope you feel like a wizard. Check out this video here if you like my list of tools and be sure to like and subscribe. Happy zapping friends and a toast to you.